Oh my god. Oh my god. Certified fit for a princess. Oh my god. Oh, so nice. I just noticed that these flowers had Sue's specifically on it. That's not a misspelling. That's not Susie. I don't, I don't understand. That's his actual writing. That's Ryan's, that's Ryan's writing. That's Ryan's writing. How did he do this? That is so cute. When, when did he do this? I'm not mentally stable enough for this. <laughs> I think this wedding has turned me into like, as if I wasn't a living rom-com character enough, this wedding has turned me into Kate Hudson in Bright Wars. Fully. Everything but the blue. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> I can't, I'm just hysterically crying. What a way to start the vlog. Everything but the blue hair. <laughs> he's driven these from home because I know the florist and he's driven them from home and brought them here at some point today. <laughs> What a way to start the vlog. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting married tomorrow. <laughs> I'm gonna compose myself and I will be back with you. I am a little bit more composed now. Hi, I also look insane. I really wanted my hair to be nice for this evening. I don't know why I'm actually trying because I'm staying in Brighton and I'm staying on the seafront and dinner is also on the seafront and I'm probably going to be blown to bits. So is this a wasted effort? Maybe, but will I look nice for five seconds of photos? Yes, and is that worth it? I think so. Always worth it for the pics. Anyway, hi, I'm getting married tomorrow. That's crazy. I'm getting legally, I'm getting legally married tomorrow. So this is not my big destination wedding, obviously. When I said destination, I was not talking about Brighton. Yeah, I am getting legally married tomorrow. So my civil is tomorrow, which if you haven't tuned in for the vlogs, like obviously most commonly civils are quite low key. However, at several points, we have slowly just tweaked this and it's basically turned into a second wedding. Yeah. A second wedding not the budget of my other wedding but still a second wedding like we have more people that we will see tomorrow evening than we will in ibiza but obviously because everyone can just like rock up and so many people have rsvp i think there's a lot of people that are rsvping that might not actually come as well like you know when you get like a yes invite and you're just like are you are they actually gonna come though like they never normally come to that i don't know we'll see also how cute is my makeup bag this is a charlotte tilbury harrods collab it's so pretty. And also petition to make more makeup bags like this, right? Like, ah, whoa, compartments. I'm obsessed and I also love, I'm convinced Ryan's having a party at our house right now. The door keeps going. Anyway, yeah, I love pink and green. This makes me so happy, so, so happy. And it's just beautiful. It is obviously brand new, so it does look pristine and it probably won't by the time I'm done with it, but Anyway, I'm staying at the Grand in Brighton, which I haven't stayed here in years. I used to stay here a lot, just randomly, whenever I needed to film like a piece of content and I wanted it to look really beautiful back in the day when we did like fancy get ready with me's, I would stay here, but I've never stayed in one of these rooms. These rooms have always been like, this is a feature junior suite, which is kind of confusing because you'd think the king suites would be better, but actually they're bigger, but this is very, very pretty very very pretty it's beautiful it's got a bathtub in the room as you will have seen earlier nice sofa area bathroom is super pretty and a nice big bed as well i actually completely forgot that victoria was staying in my room and i didn't get pajamas so slightly problematic there i'm actually gonna have to let her know that i have just realized i didn't pack pajamas lol <laughs> I'll sleep in my dressing gown, it's fine. Yeah, so <laughs> honestly, what is my life? So I'm staying at the Grand, so nice. I think it's gonna be amazing for photos, especially with the dress that I have. I just think it, it just works beautifully. I'm very excited. I'm being joined by Victoria, as I just said. So me, Victoria, Victoria's bestie, Rebecca. They've just flown in direct from Milan, so Rebecca is with her. Can't wait to see her. She's amazing, love her. My fave human being in the world, Rosie, and her friend Liv, they've all come down. They've all come, like, 
Vic and Rebecca from Milan, Rosie and Liv from London, and they are all here. And tonight we're gonna go out for dinner. And I'm so excited. And me and Vic are gonna have a sleepover. And then we're going to get ready together tomorrow. Go get me married, have a nice dinner slash lunch. It will probably be my breakfast, let's face it, because I just am terrible. I hate breakfast. So all meals in one apparently tomorrow. Evening situation with everyone, buffet sitch in the evening. I'm looking forward to it. It's been a slog to get here. Why? My camera's funny. We don't need to see that much of my hair, do we? I'll update you tomorrow on my new thoughts post being married. But at present, I don't love the venue's organization and they have had a lot of staff switches and it has been very, very, very stressful for me. I can't lie. My other, my destination wedding, seamless love them so much love like adore them they're the best people yeah at present kind of struggling with the organization but i think we're basically there now my floral arrangement my faux floral arrangement that i made it was beautiful i'm gonna pop a photo on screen because it might not actually make it tomorrow it basically fell apart on me as i was transporting it earlier today so a great day has been had so far today yeah i was basically at the end of my tether i think my mum was basically crying she was she was very sad for me i honestly have got to the point where i was just like i'll just redo it at the venue tomorrow no one knows how to do it apart from me please take this comically by the way this story this is not me complaining this is not going to be a five minute segment on me complaining but when people say oh but you're so good at that you could do your own florals it doesn't mean you should it doesn't mean you should and i will carry on repeating that for all the brides out there that think oh i could just i should just you know because i'm good at this kind of no no one needs it. No one needs it. And when you don't want to do something and someone tells you you should, carry on saying no. That's my advice so far. Maybe I'll have a different perspective on it when we're done and I actually have the enjoyable experience as opposed to just the stress. But these are my learnings so far. Now that I'm like out the other side, I still... I, I kind of wish I'd carried on saying no. We live and we learn. Unfortunately, you only do these things once, ideally. So um, I've learned for nothing. But anyway, it's all done now. And I'm so excited to just have fun and live my best life for the weekend and cover my dark circles. Wow. I'm just a tired gal today, guys. Yeah, I'm so excited for dinner. Can't wait to just like chill with the girls. It's gonna be so nice if I feel like it's getting dark already. I think it's just because it's got cloudy, but winter is coming. She's on her way, she's en route. Also, I'm staying here again tomorrow night. So once we get back, by the way, this this thing here, not part of the decor here, that's my teddy from home. I'm staying here tomorrow as well. So Ryan is actually gonna be joining me tomorrow night, which will be so nice. It's gonna be so nice. It's just gonna be a lovely weekend. Can't wait. I cannot wait. Still got a few admin bits to sort, I can't lie, but we'll do those. Maybe with a drink at dinner. <laughs> Although I haven't drunk in so long. I think maybe, maybe a month or two, a month and a half, because I've been trying to just look really, really nice for the upcoming festivities. Is now a good time to start? Because I kind of want to look nice for tomorrow. So I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't, but my God, would I love one right now? I've been very wholesome lately and I've really been loving it but would also love a margarita more than more than most things where is victoria she called me ages ago saying she was coming up hi babe right okay i'm gonna get some bits now and come to you Victoria's been here two minutes since she realised she's missing a shoe. Yeah. <laughs> I, I literally put everything so precariously in this bag and then I've come down five flights of steps and I think there's a, there's a shoe somewhere on the staircase. A Jimmy Choo shoe is somewhere on the staircase. I'm going to have to go all the way up five stairs now oh my God. to find it. You look really cute today though. Do I? On the, on the bright side. I need to, I need really to. cute. Oh, gosh, I Milan suits like, you. Thank you. I've loved it, I've loved it. I'm so excited to be here. Can't believe this weekend's here, Suze. I know. I said it feels... How beautiful she looks. I said it feels like it's been about six years that I've been planning this civil. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be so amazing. I'm going to get so emotional. I was getting really emotional on the way here thinking about it. I was like tearing up. 
<laughs> I got here and I was just crying. I had to, I was like, I'm going to be back with you and I've composed myself. Oh, babe. Really? Yeah, it's just a lot, isn't it? Maybe we can have tears tonight at dinner and kind of get all the emotional. Maybe emotion after dinner. Out. Or after dinner. Yeah. Yeah. In bed. Gosh, our makeup with, looks with unbelievable. Line. Thanks. You look so glowy. Also, the sunset is so nice. Wow. That's so nice. To the bride to be <laughs> I'm never getting my engagement ring back. <laughs> it actually really does suit you. It really suits you. Damn, I had the wrong one. You can have it tomorrow. <laughs> Don't touch me. I'm never getting that back. You wear every day. Please take this. Victoria's ring on me. <laughs> we've just realised. We've just realised that we're the same ring size, which has now changed my wardrobe game. <laughs> Shoes. It won't be. It won't. I've got good good vibes. There's a lot of packaging going on in here. This isn't the seamless process that I've envisioned for this moment. <laughs> so elegant. For a second I thought that was my dress. I was like, that's, that's not the right colour. Oh Didn't learn was how to put one of these in. <laughs> the hairdresser will know. Oh no, wait, that's that's you. She's me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll know. I'll know how to do it. <laughs> You've done one before, right? Yeah. Great. Wow, look at the fail. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh gosh. It's so pretty. Look at Back's the best bit, which it doesn't really show on a hanger, but it's the best bit. Do you want to show it now or later? You can't really see it very well, because it needs to kind of be on. Yeah, true. But it's backless. Beautiful. It's got all the gorgeous little buttons, and then we have this bow, which... Does this like clip on? Yeah, so I have to put the dress half on, get it around my waist, and then we put this around my waist and it sits oh like oh I, I see and then i put the rest of the dress on wow <laughs> <laughs> i can't stop making that noise <laughs> me too oh wow Suze. oh that's pretty oh that looks gorgeous oh look perfect a little steam i'll do the little steaming in a little minute yeah, of course I will. Yeah, a little bit on the arms. Oh, arms. Yeah. It's always arms. Otherwise, it's pretty perfect. Yeah, maybe a tiny bit Yeah. Oh, and down here, oh, yeah. yeah, the train will need it a little bit as well. I'll sort it. I'm a pro at steaming. You actually are. You and Alex. Alex is the fastest steamer I know. <laughs> actually, you might be faster because you're very impatient. So yeah. But you'd be. That's so true. Mega fast. <laughs> It's the morning of my legal wedding. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous morning. A rarity, some might say, in this town. So I'm feeling very grateful and very blessed. Doesn't look mega windy either. You have to whisper that very quietly because the weather gods might hear me. But it looks beautiful. Oh my god, my voice is going, that's weird. Yeah, I am in my getting ready dress. Just put my hair in a roller. I was going to do my hair before Rhea, my makeup artist, got here. But I, I decided to have front pieces and I wasn't originally going to have front pieces. And now that I'm having front pieces, I don't want that to like, they're like very wispy front pieces and I don't want it to mess with the makeup. So now I'm thinking I might have to do my hair at the last dying second under some real pressure and I'm a bit concerned about that. But it's all gonna be fine. It might be that I can maybe do the rest of the bun but keep my hair in the rollers, but I'm not sure. 
I don't know, things I should have done. Get a hair stylist. I might I might still do that before I be there. I have time. <laughs> so I'm not sure whether to just leave it like this. A bun is very quick in all fairness. I should be able to whip it together at the last dying second. But the tan is tanning. The tan is really tanning. I'm very happy with this. This dress, by the way, is from Meshki. It's so nice. It's so nice. Perfect for like photos in this room. I think it just really suits it. Now I have the issue of I need to find something to get ready in for Ibiza because I originally ordered this for Ibiza and then realized that it worked really well here. Wishing future me luck, but that's tomorrow's problem. Oh my God, it's so pretty here, look. It's so nice, you can see the pier. You've got one pier over here and West Pier over here. Fun fact, one of my great, great, don't know how many greats, grandparents used to own this. He bought it for a pound and now it looks like that. But when I say we've lived in Brighton for an eternity, that is what I'm talking about. We've been here as long as the pier. <laughs> the dress is looking so nice. Oh my God. I am so glad that I get to see it like in this room. It just hits different to seeing it out of its like bag at home. It looks so stunning. Can I have like a little bit of brown like under my eye? I love this song so much. It's because it's the Billie Eilish one. <laughs> and I just love Billie Eilish's voice. The nerves of having someone else do your brows. I know. Oh no, it's looking good. It's looking good. I love this song so much. No, the dopamine hit is still, still happening. It makes me so happy. I mean, I'm having my brow done right now because I can't bop to it. No, no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. I heard this thing recently about like there are certain songs, like there are like ovulation songs and there are like oh. luteal songs. And there, so there are like certain songs that certain people like certain types of songs. And the ovulation songs are like they're very happy, like sassy, sexy ones. And I was like, that is the only kind of music I like. I was like, this makes so much sense as to my music preferences now. Are we twins yet or distant cousins? The Botox is definitely like helps level them out. They used to be like very, very distant cousins slash maybe not related. <laughs> Yeah, maybe just blend, blend out a little bit more. And if I could have like just more darkness put along here, like up until, again, up until like here. Or even just like to here, and then we go in with the liner. Yeah, perfect. I really like that. Oh my God, have we got the same thing? Oh, jewelry bag, that's so funny. Oh my God. Would you go for silver and gold? I've got my Bucciolette. Which is gorgeous and big, because look gorgeous on your finger. Because that could look really pretty. That's definitely more of a this thing. Oh, oh, that looks so cool though. Isn't it pretty? That's amazing. Oh my Thank god, you. it looks really yeah, good. Yeah, I like that a lot. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Something borrowed. Hey. I have light. Hey. It looks so good. Nearly there. Mmm, that is really nice. I haven't used that one before. Yeah, it's so nice. Okay, great. Lashes set. I haven't curled my lashes since I was about 18. You don't curl your lashes? No. I can't do my makeup like that. Yeah, same. Mine's so straight. Mine are so long that I actually think like sometimes not curling them is really helpful because otherwise they're too close to my yeah. actual yeah. eyelid. They decided in the past 24 hours that these, this gang at the front likes to clump together. That's fine, we can separate those. They never normally do it. Honestly, we could go ahead and drown me. We could go have a good <laughs> I'm scared of that. I swim in this. She wants to be wet wet. <laughs> this is my face wet wet. God. I literally look like I've been rained on after I use this stuff. This is why I go through so much of this. This is why you have the heavy duty. Yeah, but it's so good. Like nothing moves. Wow. Thank you so much. Okay, great. Right. Hair. Who is in makeup? Who is in makeup? Oh, babe. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. Unreal. You look so good. Absolutely. Oh, you look so gorgeous. Front pieces are good. We are a go. I think low bun. Mm -hmm. You think low bun? We look low bun. <laughs> Separate. <laughs> the pressure is is on. I'm also being watched by a room full of people. Mm. Goodbye. Goodbye to these pieces. Smoothing, smoothing. She didn't think like a mirror behind your anything. I think I'm okay. Can you beat my mirror? Can you just tell me if there's bumpy bits? Yeah. What do we think? Is it? No, I mean, it is looking perfect. All of it's out. Give it some height. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think we're good. I'm just gonna yeah. give it a load of grip. Mm, beautiful, beautiful. 
Yeah, for these little, little yeah. danglies. Yeah. And that's really gorgeous. Wow. Great, right, I need to get into this dress. <laughs> It feels really like I don't think this is going anywhere. No. <laughs> it it does feel good actually. Yeah. Oh my goodness, babe. These are bright. Wow. Okay, earrings, shoes. Yeah, I think this is a good earring choice, but yeah, it's so classic. <laughs> I, Ryan, take you, Susanna, take you, Susanna, to be my wedded wife, to be my wedded wife, I, Susanna, I, Susanna, take you, Ryan, take you, Ryan, to be my wedded husband, to be my wedded husband. give them the greatest. <laughs> so it's not as full but yum oh my god these sausage rolls are so good good morning how was your wedding cake so good we love cake for breakfast I know, we had so much cake. That, this bag here is literally just filled with Tupperwares of cake. This one in front of you, the one that says, Ryan, please take me on the front. <laughs> that was also the bag that our rings were in yesterday morning. That's why it has that post-it note. Please don't forget the rings, I beg of you. <laughs> Checking out. <laughs> Look at, we have to address the elephant in the room. Ryan gave me all of his clothes for today, but we didn't realize he hadn't given me shoes. So we're gonna go get him some now because otherwise he has to wear his wedding shoes. But he's right now wearing the hotel slippers. <laughs> what a tragic way to start married life <laughs> with no shoes on. <laughs> 
<laughs> so anyway we're checking out i'm so sad i don't want to leave this has been the best like i am so glad i stayed here instead of just like getting ready at home even though like we live locally it's been the best stay here it was so nice so nice to have all the girls like i had the girls staying in the same hotel best decision best i know it was like it was obviously more budget but best 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 decision i'm so happy it was so nice for us to have a night here last night we had a little bath this morning we opened all our cards in the bath it was so nice that top is lovely lovely yeah it was so good i actually don't want to wait. i'm gonna we're going for breakfast i'm gonna go because i might cry so yeah it's just been it's been so nice yeah over and out let's go oh my god we have so much stuff flowers gifts suitcases wedding dress oh my god like pray I'm for concierge you feel i don't choose like that. <laughs> I, i'm leaving something behind but... you're not oh god have you got a housekeeper by the way i thought so always okay. always well this bag is full of cake <laughs> Look, literally a bag full of cake. Delicious. Our wedding cake was sensational. Ryan ordered it. It was fully his job. It was great. Oh my god, I'm gonna miss this staircase so much. It's so nice. <laughs> oh, isn't it gorgeous? There's like a big dome up there. We did photos right up the top. There's like a huge dome. It's amazing. That's my husband checking out. Yay. 